Okay. Let's go back through and go back to the fucking item box, because we live to revisit the item box. Okay. Adds a lot of extra time to this playthrough because of how many times you have to do this. I mean, Jill is limited enough with eight, right? Like, that's fairly limited. To only have six? God, playing as Jill it makes this game so much easier. Fuck you, Hunter. I still ain't gonna kill you. Okay, let's go back out here. And back to get the one final fucking item that we need. Long way to go to get one damn item, but nothing I can do. Boy, the land, the layout of this mansion is just fucking weird. Like, try to wrap your head around it, right? I mean, I know you can memorize it if you play it a lot, but, like, try to wrap your head around, like, this being a real mansion that somebody intentionally built it this way. Imagine just trying to run around and navigate this place. Okay, back around this corner. In here. Into the blue door. into the second part of the library. No. God, I suck with these controls. And that's what I need. <laughs> Okay, here we go. Almost back out to the fucking courtyard area again. We'll take convoluted routes to get everywhere.
need to go pick up the crank and the battery so I can get into the underground area. Back around this corner. Through here. I think, I know there's a spider boss in the underground area. I think there's a save point before you fight him, though. Which is where I'll stop. If I remember correctly, there is a save point before you fight him. Hey, spider. Fuck you, spider. Hey, spider. Fuck you, spider. Enter the door. I wanna know how the T-Virus made spiders that are that big. Like, where the fuck did that come from? That th There's nothing else weird about them. They're, they're just giant spiders. Like, all the other things, the T-Virus the kind of mutated the shit out of them. J just made the spiders big. What's up with that? Pick up the flamethrower and use it again. I killed most of them with the flamethrower. Around this corner. Through here. Fuck you. Ah. Fuck you! <laughs> okay, I'm still fine. Okay, good. I was worried there because he got me twice. But he didn't get me good. Hop down. Hop up. And run to avoid the snakes. Not sure how snakes rain from the sky. Doesn't make a lot of sense, but it's Resident Evil. What do you expect? Weird shit in this game. Uh, th these are the most normal enemies that you fight, like you know, others like zombie dogs, massive spiders, all this other shit. Uh, those are just snakes. Just snakes. Why the hell does this elevator run on a battery? Who ever heard of an elevator that just runs on a battery and nothing else? That's kind of strange, isn't it? Like, the el elevators typically have, like, electricity. I realize batteries provide that, but, like, hook up the same current as, like, the rest of the house, you'd think. I mean, when, what if someone was riding that and, like, the, the uh, elevator died, the battery, like, died halfway up? Would anybody even know you were down there for a long time? Because I can't imagine that elevator gets used all that often.
can't use that here. I didn't put away the uh, shotgun ammo. Oh well. All right, now let's go back into the uh, underground section again. So we can have Wesker shoot the guy and then drop the uh, drop the crank that we need. I have to do more editing to this than I'm used to for a Let's Play. There's a ladder. Will you descend? Yes. There's where we need the crank. Well, one of the places, anyway. Might as well use this on as many of them as I can. Yes, take the shells. Take that as well. And I have a full inventory. So let's... Uh... Let's try this door. Where, where does this door lead? There he is. Now this cuts in place out and he gets shot by someone who runs away. Don't come any closer, Chris. Wait. What happened? He's got ammo Don't on him, but closer. I can't get it right now. Don't oh, hell. Oh, umbrella. Who I want it? the ammo, is, but is someone there? Crosser, what did he mean by that? Okay, got one. I need to pick that up, but I can't right now. Let's go kill more with the fucking... Okay. I killed three of them. Ah. Ah. 
Yes. And that'll unlock the door. You pick it up, you use it, you put it back down. Now I need to go pick up the crank. Now let's examine the cranks. Check. X crank, okay. And check. Give me his ammo. He couldn't have moved because of this injury. He's holding something. Okay, let's go back this way. Should all be cleared out now. Or not. <sighs> it's a typewriter, but I, it's not what I'm looking for. Okay, we're almost done, I hope. I played. Imagine the kind of hand power it takes to turn a massive rock hallway like that. That thing's got a way of fuck time. This is the furthest I've been since the first time I beat Chris's campaign. Leave me the fuck alone. Is it? I have to be near.
Please tell me I'm near. Please tell me this is it. Where is it? I'm poisoned. I thought I... I thought I had a... Did it. Yes, thank you. Holy fuck, that took forever. All right, thanks everybody for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. It would be greatly appreciated. Share this video, it would help us out a lot. We will talk to you guys next time. Bye.